Look who it is. Good to see you up and breathing, Connie. <laughs> well, fuck, man. He got kind of crazy when you was taken over the warehouse in River Row, but I got out all right. Heard you know something about the Barclay train yard. Yep. This is more independent likes between the two of us. That friend of yours in the nice tan suit figured you need eyes and ears on Pete Santini's shipping operation. What's Santini up to? He's a protection man here in Barclay. You want to see whatever you put on a train end up where it's supposed to be? You got to pay Pete's people. Sounds kind of small time for one of Marcano's outfits. Give the man a prize. Ever wonder why this city's got so many guns? Marcano and Enzo got Santini running them. You bust up them deals and you put the hurt on Pete's business. All right. I'll see about getting my hands on that map. Be seeing you. The drill? Lean on Santini's people, see what they got to say. How you been? Fucking with me ain't smart, pal. Where you at? You said it, not me. Shit. Okay. Then where you wanna look?
things rattling around are gonna wreck my ears. Use mine. You can get them back later. They've been in your ears. Yeah, my ears, not my ass. Christ, princess. What was that? Got a dick. You're gonna tell me everything about Santini's smuggling racket. Mr. Santini's been doing some small time gun sales. I know where he's stashing the money. Thanks for your help. Don't like the sound of that.
<laughs> God damn, you make an impression, boy. Didn't mean no offense by that. Listen, it's not set well with Santini that people think they don't have to pay for protection. And it sounds like no one trusts him to deliver on gun deals like usual. Imagine that's got him pretty pissed off. <laughs> got him, Enzo, and Marcano looking weak. Going over to the train yard. Santini's there now, trying to figure out what the hell he's gonna do. Been fun, Connie. Keep it tucked up out there. <laughs>